Okay, so we are top working this grapefruit tree. It's a seedling, and we're adding a seedling pond can or Chinese honey tangerine to it, and the pond can's in the pot. Now I've taped about a four inch section of the two trunks together using the black electrical tape, uh, more or less five inch pieces of the tape so that I can unwrap it easily. And I got pretty good approximation. You can see that these are kind of small for the task, but it works. And they weren't exactly straight, so there's some little kinks in places where the two trees don't actually touch. There's the airspace between them, but that's okay. As long as it takes in one or two spots, we'll be all right. At the bottom, there's a lot of tension on this, so I'm going to add a clothespin to help close that a little bit. There you go. Put a little tension on that baby. And that will hold those together a little bit better. This is the place where we want to be careful not to nick this. This would be the wrong side to cut. We're going to nick the other side over here when we start to force the graft to carry nutrition to the new top. You see the top, we have large grapefruit leaves and we have the very small Chinese honey leaves in comparison. So that it'll be easy to tell which is which on the top, but we have to be careful when we're uh, working down here. We don't want to nick it back yet because these are lower limbs on a tree and of course you know the natural progression for these lower limbs is to die anyway. So you have to be careful not to be upset at yourself. Should it not survive, it might have been just destined to go ahead and die so that the top of the tree can survive where the, where the sunshine is. And the very top of the tree is going to, of course, get bigger and bigger in the natural progression. And the bottom of the tree will die off and uh, you know, just fall to the ground because it doesn't get the sun and that's what damages it. So we don't want to stress it too much. We're hoping that this branch that we used is not one of those branches that was destined to die soon. It's hard to know though. At any rate, I'll give you a follow-up in a month or two. Good luck grafting.